This video will show you the assembly process for your Champion 27 or 30 inch snowblower. Allow more than 20 minutes for assembly, and always have someone to help you. Follow along in your operator's manual. First, set the box on a flat level surface and cut the shipping bands to access the unit. Your snowblower ships partially assembled, so carefully cut the corners of the box to fully access the unit and only remove the loose parts from the box to begin assembly. Step 1. Attach the lower handle. You will need the provided 13mm wrench. Attach the lower handle to the snowblower base using the appropriate hardware and the provided 13mm wrench. And repeat on the other side. Step 2. Attach the upper handle. Connect the upper and lower handle with the appropriate bolts, washers, and locking knobs. And only attach the two lower knobs and leave them loose until the end. Step 3. Attach the chute pivot assembly to the bracket on the chute. Align the round and square connector to the bracket on the chute. The square connector will snap into place. Then, place the entire chute over the two posts, aligning the chute with the base. Step 4. Attach the cable wire guide. You will need the provided 16mm wrench. Place the cable wire guide on the discharge support using the appropriate washer and nut, and securely tighten with the provided 16mm wrench. Route the cables through the support guide and the cord clamp on the lower handle. Using the lever on the upper handle, check that the discharge chute can fully rotate in both directions. Once the assembly is complete, adjust the top handle to a comfortable height and fully attach and tighten all four locking knobs. Then connect and clean up the cables using the provided cable ties. Your snowblower assembly is complete. Follow the steps in your operator's manual to add the correct amount and type of engine oil to the engine, and fresh, regular, unleaded gasoline to the fuel tank. Inspect your unit before and after each use, and always refer to your operator's manual for safety guidelines, operation instructions, and maintenance procedures.